All right, lastly, let's hit on the Lakers. Their biggest news over the break was LeBron announcing that he wants to play with his son, Bronny. Uh, six games from a top six spot, so it's looking more and more like a play-in for them at this point. Rip, what's the ceiling for this Lakers team? Well, I mean, anytime you got LeBron James on your on your roster, you it's really hard to bet against them. Uh, I would say that their ceiling is to probably still make it to the East, the Western Conference Finals. Uh, hopefully AD comes back and bounces back off an of injury. But when you got two of the top five, top 10 guys in, in, in our league, you, it's hard not to say that they're still in this to not make it all the way to the Western Conference Finals. They just been in a rut all season long. I, I, I just don't think that the things that need to be fixed for them can be fixed, uh, especially this season. So uh, I, I will say the Western Conference Finals, I don't think they're good enough to make it to the finals, but when you got them two horses on, on, on your team, I, I give them a chance to make it that far. He is CBS Sports basketball analyst and the former NBA champion Rip Hamilton joining us to discuss the return of the NBA. Thanks, Rip. Good to see you, buddy. Seven yes, games sir. in the league tonight as they return from the All-Star break. The Bulls trying to take sole possession of top spot in the East as their tug of war with Miami continues. They welcome Atlanta. We already talked about DeMar DeRozan and how great he has been as of late. No team in the NBA has more wins than the Suns since the Chris Paul trade, but they will be without him for the next six to eight weeks after busting his right thumb. And Steph Curry hoping his 50-point All-Star performance translates to the regular season as the Warriors try to close the gap between themselves and the Suns. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.